Hey, hey, welcome to the channel today. Uh, you know why we're here, the Bandit Challenge. That's what everybody else is doing. I'm sure you're doing it too. Um, I am want to know, in this bad boy, this is like my 18th time playing and this is the best start I've had. So it's way good for me. And I think I have a chance at this one. Go and want to know. Yeah, I probably have like 80% chance of winning now. Um, I did happen to get the gold chest once, and then I got up to the 8,000 gold, but I can't seem to get that magic chest, so whatever. Anyway, I'm gonna get right into it. We're gonna play a battle or two, um, just because, you know, see how good we do. Oh, I love the golem. Since I suck at him, I'm gonna start playing him in these draft challenges and see if I can't do better. Um, we're gonna use the goblin barrel sometime in this game, and then with, he's got the, uh, we're gonna use the witch. Oh crap, I got a really heavy deck. I'm gonna have to take the log because I have the, yeah, I have way too heavy a deck here. Um, so I don't think I'm gonna use the golem for the first half of the game. Um, see, we'll just wait till double elixir maybe and see what we can do with that. Actually, I might use him right away. We'll see what he does. I'm gonna wait for him. Oh crap, cease. Okay, we'll put the cannon up there. Maybe we can take that out with, Oh, that bandit, she's so sly. She's just sneaky, she's sneaky like that. Watch that, watch how quick she is. Okay, we have no defense for those minions. That's okay, that bandit might get to the tower. Oh <laughs> yeah, you see that, that was awesome. <laughs> oh man, she did so good. Okay, so when she gets to the tower, she does a ton of damage. I actually left her alone one time and I think she did like 2,800 damage to the one tower and so that was embarrassing. It was a, it was a horrible mistake on my part and it's one I'll never do again, obviously. So I don't know what I'm going to do about that P.E.K.K.A. That's going to be a problem when it comes around. Um, so I'm going to keep the pressure on him so he can't back up. Oh, that didn't do very good. I just did a Goblin Barrel, so basically he can put something right behind the P.E.K.K.A. So he's going to put a whole... Okay, a whole bubble... Mm, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm pretty screwed. I am pretty screwed. So we're going to slow everything... <laughs> okay, that makes sense. Let's go ahead and launch a balloon, too. Maybe that bandit can do something. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> okay, come on. Okay, okay. <laughs> I don't know, I think I'm toast. Okay, so that tower's gone. So, I actually didn't like that tower because that was my left tower and I'm right-handed, so... Oh crap, I gotta go ahead and focus on that one. Jeez, please! Okay, so that was pretty good for, for him because he um, slid in there with the balloon at the last second. That was clearly a sign. Clearly, clearly a sign. Clearly a sign. Okay, so he did pretty good. Okay. On that, on that one, he did pretty good. On that one. And so we're going to get right in. Oh, one and one. This is how I normally start these. So I feel more at home now. So I'm, I'm comfortable with that. I'm going to go ahead and use the Prince. And then we are going to use... Hmm, he'll just... Fireball. I'm going to use... I'm going to use Fire... Or the Ice Spirit. Hmm, I'm thinking about this one, actually. I'm thinking about this one. Hmm. Let's use... Let's use, uh, let's use Lumberjack. Okay, and then let's, hopefully, hopefully we'll use Princess. Whew, this ain't looking good either, guys. I swear, see, my decks all, I just have no synergy in any of my decks. And I hate this stupid thing <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> Crap. Oh, I got two Princes, so that's good. I've heard that's a good good deck. I've heard that's a good deck. Double Prince or something like that. So he's going to start RG in the back. So he has RG, a Sparky behind RG. So we're pretty much... Hopefully we have some good defenses here. Oh, we got Rocket. That's good. So we should be able to take that out and that out. Hopefully. Come on, free save. Oh, perfect. That's good. That was actually really good. Oh, he distracted my Prince over there, which I'm not too worried about because I wasn't too worried about their push. I just kind of want to stop this push over here. And that makes sense. Come on, let's take out those Fire Spirits. Come on, get to the tower. Oh, wow. She does a number on that furnace, didn't she? Okay, you can take out that Princess. I'm going to use this Princess. <laughs> Okay, that worked really well. Excellent, thank you. Thanks, I appreciate it. And it was really well played, thank you. Oh, we have an Inferno Tower. That's gonna work great. I should have saved it for the Royal Giant, but I didn't, because why would I? Um, so we're gonna put Dark Prince up here, I think. And that way, if he puts his archers or his skeleton army down, we should be able to combat them a little bit better than using just the regular prince. So we're going to throw a double prince down. Perfect. Perfect. And then that... Oh, that barrel is going to do pretty good against us. But not that great. Where's his Sparky? I want him to throw Sparky out and I want to just rocket the crap out of him. He didn't throw him out. Dang it. 
The bandit does pretty good against archers, just so you guys know. Actually, we'll see how good she does. We'll see how good exactly. Come on. Except the fire spirits might be a little bit of a... Oh, excellent. She's going to get all the way to the furnace. Check this out. Oh, man, that's so good. She does so good. She does so good. She's... If you can use her correctly, she does great. All right, so we're going to use um, Dark Prince here again. Perfect. And then as soon as RG gets up there, I'm hoping we're going to be able to take... Ah, oh, dang it. Oh, that is not good. That is not good. So we're going to have to throw Lumberjack, and then we'll throw her down just to go around and, like, clean everything up, hopefully. Um, I don't know how great she's going to do, but we're going to have to use the Infernal Tower. Oh, crap. I think I was... Oh, I wasn't delayed. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, we should be able to take that RG out, and then we'll use Dark Prince over here to take out... Oh, crap. Man, that is not good. He's already back to the Royal Giant. How's that even possible? How is that even possible? That's okay. Come on, we can stop this. That's not going to be a problem. Okay, perfect. So we're going to throw... Oof. I don't have any direct damage, which is a huge problem. So we're going to throw a Prince back there. Lumberjack. Hopefully we can stop that little thing from running in there. Yep, we did just fine. We'll throw Ice Spirit. Hopefully distract those Fire Spirits a little bit so it doesn't take out my whole army that I got coming his way. And then the Prince, if he gets all the way to the tower. No! So close! Yes! We got him on the tower. Oh, that worked out great. Okay, so that's excellent. So that was a good, good, good win right there. Um, okay, so this challenge... Dude, I don't know why, but I've been facing some crazy tough decks. I'm sure you guys have too. Anyway, um, hope you guys win it. I'm not going to bore you too long. You've seen, there's like hundreds of other of these challenges on here. I just want to play a few matches for you. Anyway, um, if you like what you saw, go ahead and uh, comment below and leave some likes and subscribe to the channel. I appreciate you dropping by and we'll probably see you next week. Thanks.